Hi everyone! So, as you can see, it's pretty laid out. I just got done watching the 4th of July fireworks from my window. Happy 4th of July, everyone! It was really good to be able to watch them. I, uh, I always look forward to those every year. Now, today we're going to try something a little different from what we've done before. Uh, if you were following my videos, uh, the first video I did was uh, some two-dimensional drawing on some paper. I tried to teach everyone how to draw their face. Last week I tried to do some 3D model making with marshmallow people. It was very cute. It was very fun for me to make, anyway, to show you guys. And today we're going to do something that was recommended to me. Uh, they're called straw airplanes, and they're kind of like paper airplanes a little bit. You can throw them through the air and whatnot, but I think they're a little easier because you don't have to fold anything, and I'm really bad at folding, honestly. So I have all my materials right here. You're going to need four straws, a couple strips of construction paper about this thick, some tape, and some scissors for cutting. Now, I'd recommend that you have your parents do this, but if your parents trust you with scissors, go ahead, you can do it yourself. So I already have my things cut, so what we're going to want to do is you're going to want to take a longer strip of paper. So here's my construction paper. This is the full width of the construction paper. And I'm going to grab a little tape here. And it's not too difficult. I am just going to put it on one end and we're going to make it a big loop. Bam. Easy. And you're going to want to do that again with a smaller one. As you can see, this one is, see if I can show this, much smaller. I think I used a little bit, about three fourths of the length of the construction paper for this one. It's much smaller. Maybe a little less than three fourths, three quarters. Then you're going to want to take your straws, four of them, and I'm using uh, blue and white straws and red paper, 4th of July, American flag colors. And you're going to want to put tape on either end of them. Oh, kind of messed up the tape there. So we'll do it again. Oh boy, yeah, tape's getting everywhere. And like that. And we're just going to try and stick these on. I'm going to do it on the big paper first. And try and stick them on at the four cardinal directions. So that's north, south, east, and west. They're called the cardinal directions. And try and keep them straight as well, going off. So they'll bend a little because of the nature of what you're putting them on, but. Everything should work out okay. And remember, if it's not perfect, that's okay. You can always try again. I have my tape sticking together at the ends here. Just trying to peel this off very slowly. There we go. I'm going to try and keep the tape from sticking to itself. One more. There we go. As you can see, I have it on the four points. And I'm going to take this small one and I'm going to stick the other ends of the straws with their tape on to this. And voila! Now I will test this and I'll tell you if it works. It did. Give me one second. Ah, ah, ah. It worked. Here, I'll show you. I wanted to give it a test run. I'll see if I can catch this on camera. Haha! -ha. Look at that. Now, how this works is that when you throw it, the air passes through the straws and through the big loops. And the air presses through it quickly enough that it helps keep it afloat a little longer. This also works because this is so light, right? It works on kind of the same principle of how 
birds are so light that they're able to get off the ground by flapping their wings. Kind of a sim kind of a similar principle that it's so light and the air passes through in a very particular way that helps keep them aloft. So that's it, really. Just looks like this. Got one small loop, one big loop, and you just give it a toss and it goes. I promise. If it doesn't work, just give it another go, and I'm sure it will. And I hope all of you watching enjoyed this very much. I know I did. And I hope you'll watch my video next week of whatever I will be doing then. Thank you very much.